Well, hello there, passengers. Welcome aboard for another video with Crowley Afro, and uh, we're doing the final bus that it comes with the Free Generations DLC pack for OMC2, and this is probably my favourite bus. Uh, it it's the oldest. It's the same kind of version as the 1999. It's basically the same. It's the 405 or 0405 uh, Mercedes. Um, articulated bus or whatever but it's 1992 to 1993 version so it's a bit older it's uh, you know it's it's not as modern and chic inside as maybe the, the, the 2012 one or even the uh, 1999 one but it's still a bus and it still does its job and it's good we're going to be doing uh, we're going to be on line 137, we're going to go to Frodstrasse, uh, uh, however you pronounce it, I'm, you know me, I'm just so bad at the pronunciations. But anyway, yeah, I've got it, it also it comes with the normal BVG kind of livery, the nice boring beige colour, just to match it. it has some, uh, this one comes with the most liveries, I was tempted to do an Air, Ber uh, Air Berlin kind of livery, but I like this, I just I just keep it uh, simple and also with the, all the other uh, AI buses on the thing. Anyway, uh, on the on the on the map. Uh, Shoutouts for this video will go to Norbert Ku Kumi K Kumi Kumi Kumi. I, I don't know how to pronounce that, but Norbert Kumi 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 Kumi. Uh, and the second one goes to Tony Boney Bar Train Films. I hope I'm saying that right. Tony Boney Bar Train Films. I'm guessing, yeah, Tony Boney Bar Train Films. So that is Norbert K uh, Kumi and uh, Tony Boney Bar Train Films. <laughs> some epic names there. Uh, their links will be down in the description. Please show them some love. Those are the shouts for this video. Again, Norbert Kumi and Tony Boney Bar Train Films. Hopefully I've said those right, ace. <laughs> anyway, let's continue. I've already tapped in all the stuff we need to do for, uh, like, I've already tapped in the, uh, the the timetable here, as we can see. Timetable from Hamburg, Hamburg, Hanneberg, whatever. Uh, we're going to uh, Franzstrasse Falk, Falkensy, I guess it's called. And, yeah, we... It automatically, as I said in previous in the previous video, like this one has just you just type it in the destination thing on the like alt menu, and it comes it it, it basically puts it automatically in a, and it already comes like with a with the, the announcer thing already in and it's just it's brilliant for the oldest bus it's pretty easy to set up. Anyway, let's just get the lights on. I do believe that's it. Lights are on. Let's head. We're, we're basically driving late. We're doing a late kind of like drive. So even though it says plus 21 minutes, we're just driving as an additional bus. That's what I like to tend to do now. Uh, anyway, let's get the engine on. And as normal, we can't hear the actual engine because it's all the way at the back. Hopefully it's turned on. I'm, I'm, I'm hoping it's turned on. Yeah, I'm guessing it's turned. I think this one has to build up brake pressure. I think I'm not too sure. Let's basically put it into drive, handbrake off. I think we've actually put it on. I don't think we put it on. Go. No, I don't think we put it on. Neutral, handbrake. Interesting. There we go. There we go. I hear. I hear. I hear the ignition. I hear the. There we go. Oh, hear that. Hear that engine. Damn, that is that's is an old. Oh, we're keeping up. A, let's let's just move forward. Anyway, handbrake off. Drive. Let's go. Takes a bit of a build up. Yeah, there we go. It's not as responsive as the other two buses. Obviously, it's a bit older. Uh, but I like it. This is probably my favorite bus. I always like. I tend to like the older buses. Some new, some newer buses are cool. Wow, I really overshot that. But I definitely do like this. This bus is so cool. Uh, I think no, it doesn't. I, I don't think there's any automatic door button for this for this bus. But we'll we'll see how it works in this bus. Basically, 
Hey man, let's put the thing on. Let's check if. Wait, whoa. Am I. Oh, sorry. Did I overshoot? Did I overshoot that bad that you guys won't get on? Yep, I overshot because you guys definitely didn't want to get on. Okay, come on aboard. Oh, oh and look, we have, we, have, we have the people that want to get on through the middle door. Typical, typical. Typical Germans. Anyway, let's, let's get those closed. Let's go. Oh, shit. <laughs> we're, still in, we're still in reverse gear. Let's go. Power. Excellent. Perfect. Perfection. Ooh. And we're already overshooting somewhere. Now I think someone's already. No, actually, no, that wasn't the. Uh, that wasn't the. Uh, what's it? The. There we go. Announcements. I like it. All these buses come with announcements. That's so cool. And I don't think anyone wanted to get off. I don't think that was an alarm bell. I think that was like an alarm bell for some kind of electronics or something. I'm not, I'm not too sure. Next stop is. Uh, Pitlin, Pitlin is a wag. Sorry, German people. I'm really, really sorry. I'm not doing it to offend or like you know. Uh, I'm not doing it to kind of uh, be rude or anything. I I want to like one of my languages. As I've like I've said like a bit before is I would love to learn German and Korean. Those are the two languages I really want to learn in my lifetime. So. I gotta start somewhere. <laughs> and Omsi's a nice, you know, has some good stuff to, you know, help uh, the, the 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 keen German learning speaker. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what that kind of beep was. I'm not sure. People don't want to get off. But anyway, yeah, we have a uh, interesting full bus, to be honest. But yeah, this this bus it can go fast. But as I said the, 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 in the previous video, this 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 bus has a very long acceleration time. But I like it. It shows it shows its age. That's really good. It like it shows its age. It shows that it's it's an older bus. Obviously, imagine if it could just like you know quickly dart up to the speed like the twenty uh, the twenty um, twelve version, the twenty twelve Mercedes bus could. It just wouldn't really be realistic. Anyway, hello guys. Good and Morgan. Please don't use the middle door. Oh wow. <laughs> I love this. They kind of glitch when they kind of collide together. It's like, it's like a broken relationship. Just like, no, you will get first. <laughs> Guten Tag. Yeah, we'll come in. I'm bored. Yes, yes, yes. Come in. Let's go. Ooh. Damn. I forgot to reset. Oh, whoa, whoa. Give way to the bus, man. Especially if it's a bendy bus. People can get killed if you do stupid maneuvers like that. Uh, what she said. <laughs> right, coming down to... Sorry, guys. Does someone want to get off? I'm not sure. I'm not sure how to tell if people want to get off here. No, I think it's alright. It'd be so cool, like, I, I'm definitely still, like, interested in getting a steering wheel. And it probably will be something like the G27. If I, like, I kind of thought about it, if I want to get a steering wheel, because obviously I play on I play Euro Truck, and they're, like, games that would benefit so much from having such a good steering wheel. And I thought, like, I could either get a... Well, I'm not going to get a cheap steering wheel because that's just, that'll be a waste of money. A mid-spec steering wheel can be good, but then I kind of thought to myself, like, the G27 is, like, so good. And I've seen comparison videos and stuff to it to, like, say, the G25. And I don't know, like, I'd, I wouldn't mind investing a bit of money to just, like, get, like, a G27. Because I know it's good. It's probably one of the best steering wheels in the market. And people have commented uh, before on the previous OMSI videos. Uh, telling me that the G27 or even the G25, but primarily people are just like the G27 pretty much rocks. So you know, uh, I, I it probably will. Like I wouldn't, I would definitely see that as a good investment to like you know, because then I can just kind of have it on stream as well. And on stream, it would be so much easier 
because I swear the keyboard is a challenge even with this game I think with this game it's slightly better with the keyboard I think with obviously it's slightly better with the keyboard I think that's my opinion but with Euro Truck I think it's so fiddly and it just kind of I think with with a keyboard it would I mean with a steering wheel it would be like and I've, I've seen so many people say who have a steering wheel like it, it does change the whole experience like I was like watching on um, the squirrel nuts is a uh, stream I don't know if you guys watch him and like I, I love his channel and he, he was like saying like it's just, it's just such a change to have a steering wheel and he, he he would recommend anyone to have it and it's just like and those people I've watched other youtubers that have like steering wheels and whatever and they just say the exact same thing it's just until you get one until you experience the kind of like uh, the actual kind of gameplay with a steering wheel you wouldn't know and then once you have it you're gonna just want to stay on that all the time and I agree with that because I used to have some steering wheels before back in the day uh, well, like I used it on like PS1 games and I think I used it on some early PC uh, driving games and it was just so cool I remember I just set I will just oh people want to get off sorry people uh, people uh, it, it, it was just so cool like you just set it up you kind of sit in your chair and you just like you know you just oh, it's, it's it's just so cool and that's the kind of thing about also like simulation games and driving simulation games it just kind of gives you that kind of um, edge like say if you can't drive or like you're not you, like because like say right now I could drive in real life but obviously because it's expensive or whatever to drive it's just like and also like say like for OMSI I'm probably not gonna be a bus driver anytime soon I would love to just you know just have the kind of opportunity like even if it's in a game to just experience what it was and uh, what it would be like and I just love it because this game is pretty detailed and it's very enjoyable well when I say this game is detailed I don't mean like the whole kind of game is detailed I mean like say yes, the buses yes, are really detailed and I'm getting some really weird okay no one wants to get off so I'm just gonna open the front door uh, I get some really weird FP, uh, FPS dross, uh, bus. Uh, what am I saying? I'm, I'm losing my words completely. I'm getting some really weird FPS drops in this game lately, and I don't know why. Like, it stays at a stable 30, which is good, and then it kind of drops down to like 15. And to be honest, like, if it stayed at 15 constantly, I'm not saying that's bad or anything, but so it's when it changes between like a high FPS and a low FPS, that's when it kind of really. I don't know if it probably. You won't, you won't feel it in the video, but for me, it kind of, it, but when it jumps from what, a high one to a low one, that's when it's kind of can be a bit annoying. But anyway, we're on the way. It's good. Obviously, we're late. I can't do anything about that. We're just driving in as an additional bus. We're not following the the code or whatever. <laughs> right, I think they get yeah, there is a station up here. Good. All right. Uh, what's this? Uh, Lubin Diesel Veg. Right. Oh, shit. No one wants it. I think I only press the kind of uh, dash key to open the back door if people want to go on the back door and then. That'd be it. Okay, I need to release that. Why am I not going? Whoa. I'm not going. I've just completely stopped all of a sudden. Do I have to... Oh! Because it, I think it automatically closed my door, but it registers that I've opened it, and I haven't... Cl it doesn't... It didn't register that I closed it, but that's re I find that really weird. It, it basically... Yeah, it registers... It's weird. Like, it, it closes it by itself automatically. Oh, sorry. Why the hell did I... I was meant to indicate. It closes this door automatically by itself, but... Because I opened it, it, I need to close it. So, when and when I didn't close it and it closed by itself, it, the bus is registering it as it not closed, so I couldn't move, which is a bit annoying. Like it could just, you know, it's closed, but uh, it's not closed. People notice that I put Quiet Yafra as the registration plate. Can't fit, but you know. Up at front, it just says Worty Afro. <laughs> I think it's pretty cool. 
Will we get a green light? Yes, we will. Ooh, that Peugeot was not gonna overshoot me there. Lutener Straße. Luten, uh, Luten a Straße. Okay. But yeah, again, as I said, this is probably my favorite vehicle out of the pack. I would suggest it if you got if well, I would only suggest this pack if you want like some more buses and you want like bendy buses uh, or articulated buses, whatever you want to say. But I would only say if you're interested in these type of buses, then go for it because it is good. It's not that expensive. These buses are good. I wouldn't say they're the best like detailed buses ever that have been released for this game, but I definitely is anyone getting on here? I don't think so. Okay, goodbye. I'm missing that stop. I hope that bus stop bell was not for that stop. That would be really stupid if it was. But yeah, as I was saying, yeah, uh, they're not the best detailed buses I've seen for this game, but they're good. They're really nice. Uh, people were saying that the uh, in the last video I did, like when I was saying that that's my least favorite, and uh, people were saying that, but people like that uh, version of the bus because it has the best sounds. Yeah, like maybe it does have the best sounds, but. I I don't go for oh god can I thank you I, I want to close it myself I I, I like I, I wasn't really judging it on sounds I was kind of uh, judging it on just uh, the fact of like say presentation and whatever that bus comes with the least liveries and to me like I don't know I didn't like it. I like this one better I just like the more older one and even the the newer one's nice I like the nice touch screen. Uh, into uh, ticket uh, computer thing, that's pretty cool. But yeah, but yeah. Look inside. Look at. Oh, whoa, we have a full house in here. Let's let's drive from here. Let's see if I can drive from the middle here. This should be. A, this is actually a good view, to be honest. I think the sounds of this are good. But I'm pretty scared of driving like this. I can't tell. I can't. My depth perception is so bad. I can't even tell if I'm like on the right side of the road properly. Because I know I'm on the right, but how far am I on the right? Okay, damn it. We're just gonna go back to to this. Oh, look what's coming up on the 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 left. The uh, Vito, uh, Cito, and I'll do a video of that actually. In the future, off the Cito. It's a nice little bus. Nice little Mercedes bus. Um, how do I open that for you? Oh! Oh, that's interesting! So now, can I just drive off? Okay, so basically I pressed the same, basically for the middle door, the middle door and the back door have the same button, which is interesting. That's, oh, so yeah, when I press the, the halt kind of thing, which um, allows me to open, which can open the doors automatically on like more modern buses, on this bus I just press that and then I press the uh, the middle button for the middle door and it can open the, bo uh, the back doors as well. Okay, that's actually pretty cool. But anyway. We shall plow on to Fraud Strasse. Fuck. Okay. Should have been more aware of that red light there. Can put the parking brake on. But yeah, it's good. Oh, go. And the acceleration though, look at this. It's, it's a snail. Wow. Let it go. It's fighting it's fighting for, for for speed. Thank you, Mercedes car, for waiting for me. Now Oh, we have quite a bit of people to pick up here. And also a bit of people to um, drop off as well. Let's just 
And now we're gonna open the front door, we're gonna press that, and we're gonna open, I hope they open maybe both. No, okay, it's only one door that they wanna come through. Okay, that's fine. Yes, I know I'm delayed. Your bus came at the right time. Why are you waiting for that bus? That bus passed. I'm just driving it as an additional bus, so don't 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 blame me. Don't I'm I'm just driving an additional bus. I'm I'm like an extra bus. I should be I'm your savior. I've come to the rescue. Like if you're complaining about that delay, then that 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 first bus driver guy is late, and I'm just I'm as I said I'm the savior. I've come with an additional what bus. It's a nice bendy bus. It has more space inside. It bends. What more could you want from a bus? Like how dare you say you're you're appalled about my delay? I'm the additional bus. Damn that man! I got like. Makes sense, guys, right? I'm an additional bus. Like I would get, I would understand if I've deleted the AI bus and I've driven this bus late. Then sure, complain as much. But I didn't delete the AI, uh, the uh, the uh, the AI bus that was doing this time slot that I'm doing. I just ticked it as I'm an additional bus. That bus is somewhere up in front. Maybe it's late or whatever. I don't know. But I'm the additional bus. I'm the savior, and I and I, I I'm coming to the, all these people that are my bus. Oh wow. Wow, is that one free one? Okay. All these people that are on my bus are basically lucky because this is an additional bus. I'm I didn't have to do this. I could have been a, a cold heart son of a bitch and just, just I don't know, drive past and be like, no, I don't have to pick you up. And I don't know what's happening in my rear view my side mirror here because I don't know if this bus is gonna undertake me. I need to flipping turn in here. Sorry mate. Thank you. Ooh, wow. Okay. Ooh, wow. Wow, 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 wow. Okay. Um, right. Uh, basically, I kind of... Hmm. Do people need to get off? I'll just let people get off here, basically. Yeah, you guys, you guys get off. I'm sorry, guys. Actually, no, I can come back and pick you up. I'll be nice. Uh, God, this is embarrassing. But basically, I was... <laughs> I was... Uh, my Okay, I'll explain to you what my ha what my fingers were doing. I used my left hand to control the bus in the... Uh... Please don't go on the... Wow. I used my... Okay, I'll just open this door for you. Whoa. I can't open that middle door. That's not fair. Seriously? Okay, fine. We're just gonna okay, go a little bit back as well. Can I... What the hell? Come on, go back. Okay, uh, that worked somehow. But yeah, um, I basically was using my left hand on the pad P and a uh, new a new pad, and then I was using my right hand on the mouse to check that for that bus behind. And basically, my because my, I'm not used to driving with, um, I don't know who uses their left hand on the new pad key, but I wasn't used to it, so I thought I was braking, but I wasn't braking. So, yeah. whoa, I get an emergency light. Shit. Uh, uh, Is that, no, it's, it's good. I'm getting. I'm get, Oh, it's because I've uh, basically that that um. Come on. Go. There we go. Shit, we're gonna crash into the post. I know. We'll just wait here till it gets through. But basically, yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Sorry about that, uh, but uh, we're a bendy bus. We're flexible. We can, we can uh, bend out of situations like this. Or uh, in London, all the bendy buses could just catch fire and um, just be, you know, a little bonfire kind of fest. I don't know. But yeah, uh, that was a little awkward. But uh, I think we recovered well. We at least picked up the passengers and uh, allowed them to, you know, board. So I'm at least not. I'm the un whoa. Okay, I'm at least a nice driver. I I I I, I know my wrong from my right. Ooh, 
Oh, there is something really wrong with... There is something wrong. Oh, I know. No, I don't know. My bus is kind of... Okay, yeah, good. I, I, I basically had it in first gear for some reason. Because these automatic buses have um, extra gears. So say if you want to go up a hill, you can just s slam it into first instead of it selecting gears automatically and going really high and then you know shit happens when you you're in no when you're in high gears and you're going up a uh, steep gradient okay got this I got this now under control right okay I'm gonna master the doors because something is really weird with these doors okay I'm gonna open the front door which is cool I can open that one okay so I don't even have okay cool I can just do it like that that's good and look at that back door. That back door's like closing and then it's realizing that not all the passengers have kind of got off. There we go. I think that's cool. And now I can just drive off. Yes, good. Okay. That was swift. That was really nice. That was swift and that was good. And there's someone messaging me on Facebook. Naughty. Right. What's the next stop? Oh no. What's that? Uh, oh. Okay, I'm not saying that for for um. I don't want to sound nasty. Oh no, more more it starts. I thought it said horny straws or something like that. Wait, actually, hold up a tick. I think we. I think it's. Oh no, good. I, I thought it was saying. Uh, I thought that was a H. From a distance, but it's an M. So uh, no, it's it's saying the right. We are where we are. We are. We are. Whoa. We are. Whoa. Where are we actually? <laughs> uh, we are. We passed Rachtersbrand. Yeah, we're here. Sorry, we're here. We're about halfway. Kind of halfway. All right. Let's go. Oh, more red lights. The curse of the red lights, man. Power, let's go. Man, these AI cars, I'm just, I'm so, like, I'm just so against the whole AI collision thing because the AI can, well, I, well, actually, it's kind of my fault because I kind of put the AI to be very high and, uh, like, have a lot of it, and that might be also a problem that's, um, that's like making like the AI act really weird and crash into me basically. So I'll just um, I'll just leave the collision thing off and then we'll have loads of AI. That that's that's probably the best thing. <laughs> How's everyone in the back? Comfortable? Good. Someone's getting off, unfortunately. It's good. It's a nice. I like it. They look happy-ish. People are getting off. It's, uh, yeah, it's all right. Just waiting for this annoying red light. Sorry, ladies and gentlemen, the red uh, the traffic light is trolling me again. Well, it's trolling me and this one, two, three. Four. Okay, there's whoa, there's quite a lot of cars. Let me just move along and not create more traffic, basically. We don't want more traffic. No, please do not merge into that lane. Please do not merge into that lane. Please do not merge, thank you. Let the bus go first. Let the bus go first. The bus is the master. Please don't turn red. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. Sliding past here like a like a ninja. Oh, there's only people getting off. Good. There we go. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for boarding. Can I close it? Okay. Good. I think it. I think the white marker will come on for me right now. Our special little traffic light. 